It's wedding season. That's the good news. And this year is expected to be a record setter. Wedding coordinators say most people who put plans on hold due to COVID-19 are ready to tie the knot this year. Local 22's Dana Casulo talked with wedding planners and they tell us why this year it is very important to plan ahead. Dana. Lauren, according to the wedding report, a record number of weddings are expected for 2022, about 2.5 million. That's up from 1.9 million last year. Wedding season is in full swing. Right now, my phone uh, and email inbox are off the charts. Yeah, Heather Frazee is the wedding coordinator at Bolton Valley Resorts. She's already taking many bookings for next year. For 2023, I have 14 weddings booked. Um, I anticipate, <laughs> especially this past week, another um, a dozen at least. Um, uh, people are inquiring because I think they realize dates are filling up fast. That's not the only place. At the lodge at Spruce Peak, it's going to be a busy summer. This summer we're seeing some weddings that rebooked three times, wow. rebooked for 2021 and then canceled and now they're coming in 2022. And then we also saw last summer just a huge volume of inquiries coming in for weddings that weren't able to take place. People may have put off the weddings due to COVID, but they're not cutting back on costs. The average cost of a wedding ceremony and reception in 2021 was $28,000, according to The Knot. What they're doing for their events is more than, you know, over the top, more than what we've experienced in the past, where they really want to show their family and friends that they haven't seen some of them for a couple years and now they have the opportunity to get together and they want to make it a really special occasion. Back at Bolton Valley, Heather Frazy has advice to people that are planning their wedding. I think definitely give yourself enough time. It is definitely harder to plan something out when you're only giving yourself under a year. Um, I also say think about your expected attendance, um, how many you plan on hosting um, and from there build a budget. It's not just the ceremony and reception that are adding up. According to The Knot, newlyweds spend an average of $5,000 on a honeymoon and $6,000 on an engagement ring, driving up the cost to $39,000. Reporting live in the newsroom, Dana Casulo, Local 22 News.